India Today Aaj Tak News Director Rahul Kaval spoke to Swaminathan Gurumurthy, the editor of the Tamil political weekly magazine Tughlaq, on the ongoing India vs Bharat storm. Listen in to what he had to say. The invitation cards sent out to guests for the gala dinner of the G20 carry the name the Republic of Bharat. Does this suggest a move on the part of the Modi government to change the name of this country from India to Bharat? What are the ideological and philosophical underpinnings of such a move? To talk about this, I am joined by one of the most prominent thinkers of uh, India is right, ideologue of the Rashtriya Swayam Sevak Sangh. Guru Murthy Ji now joins us live on India Today from Chennai. Guru Murthy Ji, Namaste and thank you for joining us. Namaskaram, tell me. I want to ask you, Guru Murthy Ji, about the idea philosophically of wanting to change the name of India officially to Bharat. You're in uh, Chennai, it used to be called Madras. Calcutta before this uh, had its name changed uh, to Kolkata, Bombay to Mumbai. Why do you think this is the right time and the right opportunity for India to be officially renamed only Bharat? See, India was wrongly named as India. It was originally Bharat. If you take all the 18 Puranas, you take Bhagavad Purana, you take Mahabharata, whether they actually happened or not, they were all written and the entire geography of the country had been described. The people had been described, their culture had been described and they had been designated as Bharatiyas. It is called Bharata Varsha. So, this name should have been there in the constitution, but it became an alternative name. I don't know for what. For whatever the founders of uh, the constitution felt, they put it. But we have amended the constitution over 100 times for right and wrong reasons. I am not questioning the wisdom of the people who framed the original constitution. Also people who amended it because this amendment is a contextual necessity. The amendments which uh, took place in 1970s uh, became abhorrent in 1990s. So all this keep happening. But the name Bharat is not a new name. It is in the constitution already. India that is Bharat. That is Bharat is the real name. India is the name by which it is known elsewhere in the world. In those days to bring Bharat and to make it popular would take maybe several years. That is why they probably allowed the word India to continue. They also understood Bharat is the real name. But to make the world understand that India has become, that what is known as India it will now be known as Bharat. It would have taken several years those days and that is why probably they allowed the uh, name India to continue. 